Right, let's try this again. We're gonna add the quarry here now. Bosh! Wait, what? Why is this quarry so big? I wanted the line there. That is the landmark. Why is it so big? What's going on? Maybe I need to shorten the landmarks. Uh, let me try this one more time. Let's go like that. And make it a tiny bit smaller. Maybe it has to be a square. Maybe that's what, what's going wrong here. I need to make it a square. So let's go there. And then let's go there, maybe. And then we'll add the quarry once more time. Bosh. There we go. Oh, no. Now it's going lengthways. What is going on? Does it have to be a chunk? I feel like it has to be a chunk. Maybe it has to be a chunk. Maybe we're going to have to mine out the chunk. I've said chunk too many times now. How many times have I said chunk in this sentence? Right. Let's mine out the next chunk over. Okay. So I've done this little area here just to show you. I've mined it all out. I was going to mine the whole chunk out. But I thought, eh, let's just see where it goes and how far it goes down. Because uh, there's no point in doing more than we need to. And plus, I want this little area to store a lot of items. And just just to do a bit of testing with us all. So, uh, where do we have to and what do we have to do next? Well, we're going to tell you what we're going to have to do next. What we're going to have to do is click onto our inventory and see what we've got in here which is our combustion engines and we've also got a redstone engine now i want to do some testing with everyone right here right now so with a redstone engine now this thing shouldn't explode so i just threw it as i was saying this thing should not explode should not explode so we're gonna put that doesn't go in there that does not go in there why is it not attaching okay in theory it should just literally attach to no wait what that's not right I'm have a male function in here. Wait, what? Wait, what? Why are they facing up? They should be going into the machine. What's gone wrong? Okay, so we got ourselves a wrench. Let's see if this redstone engine will turn. No, why? It's meant to go into this quarry, and I am so confused, right? Why it's not doing that? Why are you not going into the quarry the way a pit thingy? Where well, I sell it to? Does it have to be a combustion engine? Ooh. Wait, if I do. Nah, so. It has to be a combustion engine for the quarry. So we're going to add that to it now. So we're going to stick three into there. But how are we going to parry this combustion engine? Well, we're going to need some fuel in there. Uh, I should have some coal on me somewhere. So let's have a cheeky little look-see. Have we got coal? Have we got coal? Have we got coal? No. Magma cubes? No. Will? Will, will, will. That's not going to work. Help. I need somebody. Help. So click on this with an empty this tanker bucket from this bucket this tank can accept any kind of fuel plus an empty bucket clean this with empty bucket to empty the tank into the bucket or the, using the full bucket to fill the fill this tank from the bucket that makes sense wait what is that then empty bucket this tank can accept any kind of fluid so if i go okay power current power owner me right oil wait what oil any kind okay okay so Wait, it can accept any kind of fuel? Why can't I put in coal then? This is very, very strange. How do we make fuel? Let's have a look. Fuel. Right, how do we make fuel? So we've got gaseous fuel, mixed heavy fuels, mixed light fuels, fuels. There's lots and lots of fuel. Searing fuel. What? I just need I just need a normal fuel. Why why can't there we go? Fuel bucket. What which is made from an oil canister. Which is made from oil. I don't know how to do that. What's that? Fluid transposer, dense fuel, okay. Don't know how to do that. Mixed heavy fuels. I just need to know how to make fuel. Just a simple, simple, this is how we do it. This is how we make fuel. It doesn't tell us how to make fuel. Uh oh, what's on the next page? What's on the next page? Nope, nothing. <gasps> oh no, how do we make fuel? I would have thought it would have been that. I would have thought it would have been that. Have I made the wrong one? This is not good. So, slight change of plan. Uh, apparently, we need to build an oil refinery in order to make fuel, and then we need buckets and everything like that, and it, that's a whole long-winded process, and we're not quite there yet. Uh, I could borrow from the communal area, but I'm not going to. No, this is our single SMP, slash, yeah. But I'm not going to do that. So we're going to utilise these, the Sterling engines. I don't want you. In fact, you can go back in there. There's no room in you. Oh, no. There's no room. There we go. You can go in there. So off you go, engines. We'll utilize you for something else later on. So what we got here, Sterling engines. Sterling engines require flame. So it accepts any fuel that furnaces. So we've got a couple of blocks of coal here. 
So we're going to just simply attach, say, five in each. Five should, five should surely uh, be enough not to explode. Now, there is... There is... There is a slight chance that these may explode. But, you know, we're going to have to uh, take that risk. Because the last thing we need right now is things exploding on us. Uh, but in order to combat that, all we need is a couple of buckets. Why do we need a couple of buckets? Because, well, we need to go get some water. Because I've built more things, more things to be powered, to have less explosions and things like that. Where, uh, but we need to go to the outside where there's... That's a zombie. Go to sleep. Hey, you've been in my crops. Zombie's been eating my crops. Right, we need to go head down to the water, get our buckets. Shroom, get a couple of buckets of water. One, two. Head back up into the farmhouse. Why have we come over here? Because we need to make a water source. Not just any water source. We need to make a... Unlimited water source. This area is going to be my little, uh, like, area where we can uh, do stuff and not have to worry about items and things like that. So, these are obviously going to overheat. So, my plan is, my plan is, if we look here, if we, should, if we look here, these can overheat and explode. So, my plan is to put some water into here. But we need, to, in order to do that, we need a water pump, which I've got here. That wasn't meant to go there. <laughs> You're meant to go on top of the water. What are you doing? Uh, so if I go, I need to place. I need to place blocks. I've got no blocks. My inventory's full. Oh, there's so much to do. There's so much to do. Right. I need to get you. No, I need to get you. Then I need to mine you. This is. Stay with me, guys. Stay with me. Stay with me. Stay with me. Place that on there. That's now going to suck up water. Look at that. Straight into there. <laughs> Getting all that lovely luscious water. So we're going to run the golden fluid pipe. I Hopefully I've got enough. This way. I should have enough. He says. Eh. Reach underneath. Can I? Reach. Wait a minute. I could just do that. <laughs> Me trying to struggle. But we should be able to. No. There we go. You can go in there. Oh, I'm running low. I'm running low. You in there? Can we? Wait, do you connect up to here? No, so can I not cool you? These must be for the combustion engines then. Uh, right, so we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. We're all, it's all testing here. Let's get the transport pipe out of you. There we go. Gold, no, wait. Is that a fluid pipe? Uh oh. Uh oh. I've used the wrong one. I've used the wrong one. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna stick. We want the items coming out of here. So what all we need to do is get a transport pipe. Hopefully I've got enough. If not, I'm gonna have to make some more. And we're gonna run these to a chest. Now I'm just gonna stick a chest right next to it for now, just to do some testing to make sure that the it actually the quarry actually works. So let's get some golden pipes, transport pipes. They must be transport and going into the chest. Yeah, that looks like about right. Um, and then we need to turn on these engines. Now, I thought that we could cool these engines. I could be wrong. So, let's test it. Let's go uh, fluid pipe, fluid pipe, and see if that actually runs into there. It doesn't look like it does for now. We may have to change that to a wooden one, but we'll check at a later date. I'm hoping it does cool it. But all we can do now is add some redstone and see if the quarry works. I th wish me luck. Redstone. Oh, yeah. We've got we've got that working. We've got that working. Oh, we got, well, laser started shooting out. Wait, what? It's building. It's building. Oh, here we go. Our engines are really heating up. Oh, 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 oh. wait, 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 wait. Thirty. Ah, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. So, the engines are heating up nice and slowly there. We are building the mine. Whoa, let's wait a few minutes and see how it goes.
So as we can see there, our mine or our quarry is now actually working. We didn't need to cool the fuel down so we can actually get rid of this pipe right now because we don't need it. We can store it away. We don't have to worry about it in future. Where's my pickaxe gone? There it is. And as we can see here, the cobblestone is actually moving up through the gold pipe down into the chest. We're actually getting some ores as well with it, not just cobblestone. Now I'm curious to do a bit more testing on this. So the testing I want to do is ooh, forward. No, side to side. No, backwards. There we go. Yes, let's get rid of this. We'll use the pump for another day. We'll use the pump for another day. Because we don't need it, because we don't need to cool it. And it's not even getting any power, so that's why it was, wasn't working. Um, right, so, if we then, if we, if we do this, so, we'll stop, we'll stop, we'll stop the quarry. We'll stop the quarry there, we'll stop the quarry, because, you know, oh, that coal's burning, that coal's burning fiercely. But we'll stop that there, right? What we need to do is we need to do some testing. So I'm going to put another, I'm going to put a couple of chests here. Get the gold pipes because I want, I want to see if we can separate or if we can put a couple of these item filters in because it'd be handy for separating the cobblestone with all the ores. Show. Why have we only got three of them? Oh, I'm missing one. Um, right. So if we collect that, we want that there. The fluid pipe can go away. We've got the kinesis pipe. Let's see. Let's see, we don't need the big, the big pickaxe, we need the little pickaxe. Let's click this one. Oh, we hit two. We hit two, right. There we go. So I'm wondering, will that get in the way though? Will that get in the way? Let's, let's find out, let's find out if we can go, no. Nope. And send all the cobble down here and everything else into that one there. So, if we get some cobble out of here, we've got some cobble. I wonder if we can just put a simple filter on. So, it sends a single item instead of a whole stack each time. Overrides minimum, maximum, set. Yeah. Sykes between all connected inventories. Yeah. Okay. So, new filter. Material. Cobblestone. And then we'll name it dark blue. Save. Now. Here is the question. Will this filter? Will this filter? So we don't need to do hoppers. We don't need to do mining thingies. This is the way forward. What is the answer? Let's find out, shall we? So we'll turn on the combustion engine again. One and two. Combustion, sorry. Still an engine. Still an engine. Let's see if this will filter through. So the cobble. No! Why isn't it working? Why is it just kicking it out? Why is that just kicking it out? Hmm. Back to the drawing board. This time I've moved the logical sorter here. Now it's not connected to the main line, so in theory the cobblestone should come through and possibly get pushed through that way, or it should get absorbed, sucked through. Let's find out. Let's add the redstone to it and see what happens. We'll send the mine we'll send it off mining again. That's still burning happily the fuel. No. Why isn't it getting on on on? No. It wants to. It's asking for it. No. If I do that it doesn't ask for it. If I click on, single, so, status, save, default, allow, or save. What is going on with this? Right. Have I got it facing the wrong way? Is it facing the wrong way? Let me close that. Let's face it this way. Let's face it that way. No. Can it only face one way? That's clearly in the wrong place. The tripod there. 
No, see... Why? So, after some research, this is what we found out. Well, I'm not going to be able to separate them using the logical sorter. The reason being, this logical sorter needs logical pipes. Logistical, sorry. Logistical pipes. Not logical. I keep on calling it logical. Why do I keep on calling it logical? I do not know. But we are going to need to utilize the logistical pipe. So, in order to make the logistical pipe, let's type it in, in here. Shall we? Logistical. There we go. In order to make that, we need. Is we just need the basic one. We need steel and a basic control circuit, which we already made uh, to use fluid pipes and to make this. But let's go over here to the metallurgic infuser. Yes, we are in a communal area, and those slimes love dropping down. But we are in here now making some enriched iron. Why are we making enriched iron? Because we will put the dust back in. We're also making enriched alloys as well. In order to make uh, the... Where is it? In order to make the advanced what, uh, the advanced transporter. Just to make it a bit more effective when we are actually transporting our goods. So, once we've got a bit of enriched iron, I'm going to get 15 of them. Um, just to make it... In fact, no, we're going 14. What we do is we put the enriched iron into the metal. Hello, Mr. Do you know what? These slimes love to say hello to me, but uh, not this time. Uh, what we do is we put the enriched iron into the metallurgic infuser. That metallurgic infuser then goes into here to create steel dust. Wait, what? Apparently that steel dust is going straight into the furnace. And we're getting steel ingots out of it. Absolutely magical. So, we now can take this enriched alloy, take a couple of these steels already. Uh, what, oh, no, come back, come back, come back, there we go. We'll head over to the ME terminal. We'll click, where are we? Well, you will click the basic transporter. Oh, no, did I bring, no, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't. They're in here, but it's fine, it's fine, they're in here. We'll click the ultimate, no the basic and we'll craft we'll craft one set of them in you go and in you go oh no we can in fact we'll be able to make another set basic yes thank you very much we'll have another set of them we'll then move on to the advanced well we'll click that and then we'll do another spin there we go we'll add the alloys and create largest where are they oh they're in my, <laughs> they're in my inventory the whole time Back at the farmhouse mine, we take down the gold pipes, get rid of all them. Yay, all the pipes are gone. We get the logical transporter. We plug them, that in, that in. Split the two. Oh, we go. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, there we go. Wait, why is the cobble going into two? Wait, what? Why did that just do two? Is it because I need a different filter? Hmm. Hmm. Let's check these filters, shall we? In we go, off we pop. Let's check the filter on here. So we've got ejected automatically connected inventories. Cycles between all connected inventories when sending them items off. Single item. Let's try this, maybe? Maybe? Uh, let's power the pumps. This is very loud, so I do apologize. Go into the same one. It's filtering it so far. No, why is the... I just wanted to go into one. So, after further adjudication, it looks like we're going to require a few more items. So, we're going to keep this basic setup here. I say basic, it's not really basic, is it? But we're going to utilize this setup. Reason being is because I need a configurator and it means more making more items and it means making like and more end game stuff. But I don't want to be doing that yet. No, I want to do the simple process. So, we're going to keep with the engines down below which is uh, easy to make. We've got the quarry there. We've got the golden pipes leading in, and then we'll keep these. We'll keep the sorters so we can just get cobblestone into here, but into that main chest, we will hopefully get our uh, other gems, ores, things like that. So I'm going to leave this running and then see what we actually get out of this hole, which is slowly going lower and lower. Fabulous. And there we have it, folks. Guess what? It has stopped. Yes, indeed. Our machine has stopped. Let's go and check why it has stopped because it has reached lava. If you can see there, it is all the way down there. 
in the lava pit, unable to process anymore because it's covered in lava. Now, we will have to start looking at... Oh, God, I'm precariously on the edge there. But we'll have to start looking at uh, ways we can get around having that lava, maybe throwing some buckets of waters down there. Who knows? Who knows what can happen? But in the meantime, we're not here to look at that. No, 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 no. We are here to look at what we have in our chest. So let's go take a look. We'll go for the first chest here. Oh, we've got plenty of cobblestone there. Some uh, Certus Quartz, some coal there, obsidian. Ooh, lots of lots of crystals. Even some roots. Let's have a look in this one. More crystals in there. We've got a Rocky Princess drone or Bee Queen. Uh, what else we got? Some Lion Oil. Even some obsidian. I wasn't expecting that. In this top chest here again, we've got the Quartz. Some more crystals. Some Inferium Essence. We've really got to start looking in that. What about this one? Cobblestone, Basalt. And again, a few more ores. Well, 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 well. That's, this is the first start of our quarrying. And I'm going to end the episode there on that quarry because and start moving it and slowly, slowly quarry out all underneath my farm. Yes, that is the plan. Maybe we'll upgrade our engines. Who knows? Well, next time I want to start looking at getting into some more farming, building up our uh, streets, and then go from there. As you can see, I've already got the uh, four points on the ground laid out, ready for the quarry to go down. But my plan is, next episode, is we will jump into all the refinery process and all that good stuff. Maybe even start looking at how to make fuel, if we've got enough resources. Who knows? But, thank you all for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe if you are enjoying the series, because I'm enjoying making it for you. I've been Nev's Gaming, you've been amazing, toodaloo, and I'll see all you wonderful people in a few. Good.